What is going on guys? Welcome to today's video. Travis Patel here. Today we want to talk about 10 ways that you can improve conversions on your Shopify store. Now yesterday I did a post in the Kingpinning group where I talked about those 10 different tweaks that you can do with your website and your store to help increase conversions. It really comes down to two main areas, your branding and your copywriting. A lot of Shopify and drop shippers, they are just taking a product, putting it on the sales page, not adding any copywriting, not doing any extra steps to improve the branding, and hoping that just the product alone is going to create the sale, the impulse buy. And you know that can work for certain products, but it's typically a long shot, and it's going to cause your cost per conversion to be much higher than it, than it should be. So if we do a couple of tweaks, we improve our branding with our logo, color scheme, product names, product pictures, and then we work on our copywriting with sales prices, video demonstrations, trust badges, all that good stuff. Um, you're going to be able to have a much higher conversion rate and really create a quality brand. That's what it takes with Shopify these days. You can't just have the impulse buys leading the way. We have to have certain pieces of the system convincing the, the audience to buy the product, showing them why they need this, why they have it. People aren't searching on Facebook to find products to buy. We are showing them, we're catching their attention and then we're convincing them to purchase the product so <clears throat> As I was scrolling through Facebook last night, I saw a really great example of someone out there who's drop shipping that is using these 10 different tweaks on their sales system, and it, I bet it's working pretty well for them. And it's a great example for us to kind of mimic and follow along. So let's go ahead and take a look at the ad that I, just as I was scrolling through my news feed, I came across Rosalite, this uh, light mask therapy that can help with rosacea, it says. So very simple ad, and you can see the video ad here. 44 second ad that has them using a demonstration, text overlaying, you know, your, your typical type of video ad. Now you don't have to have a live person doing demonstrations with your ads. You just have to have kind of some, some video compiled together that's on point with the niche. Do your research, you know, kind of infomercial style. As you can tell with this ad here, it's like an infomercial. You got someone holding the product, using it. They have this little science demonstration you see there. And all those video clips and stuff, you can find that um, all around the web. You just got to do some deep research and create some really great videos with that type of stuff. You can see testimonials they're using the video. It's a really great example of a video ad being used here. Now if you click into the website, this is a very standard basic uh, uh, website. Search, this is Shopify store. They're selling one product. Now first thing you notice is that the light therapy mask for rosacea. So they use Rosalite TM. So trademarked Rosalite, more than likely this is not actually trademarked, but this is what, again, one of the main points we made for increasing conversions was don't just use uh, light therapy mask as your, your, your site. You want to have a brand name. Use something that's going to make it stand out. Rosalite TM light therapy, light therapy mask for rosacea. That's going to make you stand out quite a bit. So we have very simple stuff here, quality images as usual, and this is the home page. So this isn't even the sales page. Let's go into the sales page and take a look. <clears throat> okay, so like I said, the name, this is one of our things. If we look back here, our 10 different tweaks. We've got, we want a logo, we want color scheme, we want product name to be improved, we want good product pictures, we want sales prices so they're getting a deal, we want trust badges, we want to use a quality headline in our description, we want a dem visual demonstration, we want benefits, and we want using video advertisement. So we saw how they're using the video advertisement, doing it very well. The sales page here, we can look at these other pieces that they're using, the, the product name. So instead of light therapy mask, like a lot of people use, rose of light trademarked the rosacea phototherapy mask so there we go there's a big piece there um the price 224.95 now it looks like they're not using a sales price but they are using a quantity purchase so if you buy two three or four you're gonna get percentages off this is a great little tool and add-on to do to your shopify store to get people to buy more than one um they have the reviews. That was the one I added in there in the comments I forgot to put in the post. This is very important. Now, these are not people that purchase from this person. This person is obviously drop shipping, but they imported the reviews from AliExpress into their store. Um, you can see the pictures are all the same size, high quality. People are using it along with um, just the standard white background images. Now, we said we want a headline and we'll trust badges and all that. Looks like they're not using trust badges, at least from this point, maybe on this, the add to cart or something. They got customer 
um, reviews and testimonials right here, right below the buy, per, uh, buy it now button. Um, we have, here's our description headline. See, I, I have not done with it's going to be testimonials right there. I've actually had the headline typically above that. But here's our video demonstration. Our, our copy, here's our benefits listed in bullet point form along with some graphics. If we keep scrolling down, step by step, includes effects of different colors on skin. So it's just kind of going more. Here's our specifications getting into it. Here's our trust badges. So they put their trust badges a little bit lower, um, which that works fine. And then we have our customer reviews again, 634. So these are all imported from places like AliExpress or Amazon or other things. Because since this person is drop shipping, this product is being sold by other people. It's been sold for a while. But again, it doesn't give you a reason not to sell it yourself. Um, continue pushing forward. So we have a really great sales page example there. Now, $224.95. That is what they are priced this at. Now, I did a little research. I looked on AliExpress and I found Light Therapy Mask. Here's our top ones as far as best match. They're costing about $35. So they have a good 8 to 10 you know, markup there. Um, not quite that much, but a good markup. Going to give them a good profit margin and you know all that good stuff. So let's see, by orders. Yeah, so... 1987 to 35.33. Now, most of these guys that are drop shipping, they're probably not fulfilling from the United States, but this op this vendor does have a United States option. 615. So that's still super long time. What is the date right now? Oh yeah, that's a month away. So that's a month long, but that could also be right now with the coronavirus and all that type of stuff. Everything's really slowed down. Um, so that could be a, a reason that's going on. But if it's actually supplied in the United States, it would actually be much quicker. But still, that's okay. That's something that when you're drop shipping like these guys, um, I typically use that as a starting point. And if this was working for us, then we would go ahead and bulk buy warehouse into a U.S. based warehouse, and then we can ship within the you know three to seven days like normal. So these guys have a good little markup. Um, I checked their WordPress theme with whattheme.com, and they're using Debut. That's a free WordPress theme that they're using to create this. So very simple, laid out. Again, it's all about the branding, the copywriting, the uh, overcoming those objections of people purchasing so again this is just a great example of how you guys can create a really great shopify high converting store and look at the bottom here they have like an interesting little banner I'm not seeing that and the quantities again they get those discounts so yeah, guys, that was. I just wanted to kind of reiterate the post I made yesterday. If you haven't checked it out, go to the Facebook group. Check out that post for the 10 different ways that you can improve your conversions with copy and branding. Simple things that anyone can do. And then go check out this, this source right here. This is a great source just for an example of what you can kind of mimic when you do your drop shipping stores and your, your physical product sales, single product sales. Very simple stuff doesn't take too much you can have all this up and ready to start marketing within a day you know and then this is we uh, if you look at their their fan page they have 803 likes so they're fairly new this was set up fairly recently but they are having success because people are liking the page so probably a month or two ago they set up this store and we can probably find uh, oh, it looks like about you know six months ago or so it looks like they got this uh, cranking so it has been working for them. It's working well. This is probably a standard phone number um, with a outsource customer support group or whatnot. But again, this is just a great example of someone who set up a quality, simple, high converting um, Shopify store and is how you can set up if you're doing your drop shipping tests or even if you're not drop shipping. This is the same type of methods that you want to be following, the same tweaks, the branding, and, and so forth. All right, guys, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to post them below or let me know. Have a good one.